Russia invasion of Ukraine has been devastating. Yeah, today, Russian forces intensified their attacks on populated areas of the country. Ukraine's second largest city was targeted, as well as the main TV tower in the capital city of Kyiv. Ukrainian authorities said five people were killed and five wounded in the attack on the TV tower. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky addressed the European Parliament today, pleading for more help. Ukraine may seem like a world away, but the fighting is impacting people right here in Indiana, including the woman who owns this restaurant in Columbus. WRTV's Adam Shumes reveals her story of struggle and the tension she feels for her family right now. At Alyssa's Kitchen in Columbus. I call this the international restaurant. Alyssa Whitfield specializes in not just Ukrainian food. Ukrainian borscht, it's a soup, it's traditional Ukrainian. Yes, uh, and um, I do so many dumplings, you know, pierogi. And she'll tell you that every dish she cooks is prepared with her heart. I do everything from scratch. I love you know, I have one customer and he said, you know, I come in for your life food. That same heart that she uses to prepare every dish is heavy today because of what's going on in her home country of Ukraine. Back home, it's scary. Back home, you know, I have a family. I have my my daughter with um, her family. I have a, only one granddaughter who is, um, she's nine year old, super scared. Don't don't let mom, you know, go on any second without her. She just hold her. And I her son is in Kiev, and she says that he and the rest of her family are in a safe place. And I ask them, text me every day, you're okay. She came to Indiana more than 20 years ago for a better life, and right now her family is the first thing on her mind. I'm I'm crying 24 hours, really. It's it's just so 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 hard to keep it. Inside. That strength that she's showing is the same strength that she's using to help guide her family through this unknown time. I'm a mom, so my heart is hurting for not just Ukrainian people, for Russians too. Working for you. If you're going to see my heart right now, you know it's a, it's a blood, tears. Adam Shumes. To the family at home, just stay strong, stay safe. Uh, it's a, so hard to be a long way from you guys. And... Um, I love you, and I wish it's going to be done really, really soon. WR TV. Well, she says that she is very thankful for the community's support during this trying time. The countless texts that she has received have helped her.